This vision is for a future time. It describes the end and it will be fulfilled. If it seems slow in coming, wait patiently, for it will surely take place. It will not be delayed. Habakkuk 2 3. Soften up the mess, drop it in the water, let the daughter find an image with the rest. She'll be learning how to breathe. Spinning through identity, reveal another pretty little scheme. Save her mind. Hold her hand. And don't believe a lie. You understand me. Walk her down the valley. Pack a piece of heaven for the bottoms of her feet. Teach her how to jump and how to stretch when she reach. Like the angels do. And you gon' make it through now. Tell about the healer, greater is the one within a column as the leader. Teach her how to hold a pretty hand up to the sky. And I'ma wait up on the giver, he'll deliver like a dealer. Take her higher, higher. Fly out the valley and the fire. Take her. Running. Show her every door and how the windows let the sun in. Copy out the key and tell her this is for we come. 18 from verse 6 to 9. The amplified version is what I'm going to read. Uh, for Samuel's 18 to 9. It's a destructive emotion. Uh, I, I, and many times there are things that begin to trigger that in our hearts. Let me make a quick distinction uh, between envy and jealousy. Envy is when you want what someone else has. And when you envy someone, you want what they have. Uh, but jealousy is when you are worried someone is trying to take what you have. Uh, hey guys, what's up? Welcome to a new video. <laughs> How are you doing? So good to be here. If this is your first time stumbling on this channel, please don't forget to do the needful like, subscribe, share, comment, all the good things that you do for YouTubers. Thank you for coming and if you're an old subscriber, thank you OG, I really appreciate it. Anyways, let's get right into the video. I, I was, this video was supposed to be a vlog, but the vlog wasn't vlogging as you've seen at the beginning. I couldn't just put things together. I just wanted to just be in the moment because one, I've been very, very tired and I needed sleep and I could not do a vlog of me sleeping all through. So basically, that the vlog I was trying to do was just me sleeping and taking care of my personal life, my normal job. Like, now that i've cleared that as to what was the beginning about i hope somehow the beginning helped you especially the part of when i was in church um now that i've cleared that let's go to the um elef let's clear the elephant in the room i've been getting questions as to why have i not been consistent on youtube this year um i guess that i started getting consistent last year maybe that is why and i've also done a video about this too where i said that my first six months of the year i have made it an habit or i am making it an habit to stay off social media social media includes youtube it's just for my sanity i came on social media during the presidential election and it did a number to me i was it was just a lot for me and i was like bro sent me i am i know i'm quite patriotic I, I mean i was out and then i logged in a day before the election and i stayed till after the result was out and it just did a lot of numbers to me. I just I just said, you know what? Gubernatorial election was yesterday and I I wanted to really log in, but man, I helped myself and I'm proud of myself for that because my mental health is very important. So in case you're new or in case you do not know and you've been here for a while, the first six months of my life, of my year, of my every year is very dear to me. So I am taking it off social media. I'll be vlogging my time in those years or doing sit down videos you say in those years, in those months. And I'll, or yeah, I've been set up video vlogs in those months to document it, and so I will start posting from July. I've already scheduled three videos already, which you must have seen before this one, and then 
this one will come up and then other vlogs or sit down videos will come up now that is out of the way please i hope you guys understand and you guys don't think i'm running away or i'm not being consistent it's just how i can function i need my sanity and i need my peace i cannot start my year with chaos because i know myself i'm quite a workaholic i cannot really combine my job yet i'm still finding a balance even if i think i have found a balance and then combining it, i need rest basically i know that when i resume in july i will have to have to know how to balance it but when that time comes we cross the bridge now that is that let's move to my job you guys know from the first vlog i uploaded this year i have gotten a job i really do enjoy the job and i'm very grateful for god for giving me that job i remember last year i posted on you on instagram where i was crying i told people that i cried i posted it there that i cried that i wanted a particular job or something in particular and i didn't get it i felt i felt it like this and then it disappeared a particular job and it really helped me but now looking in retrospect i know i said in that in that um i put in the caption where i said god has a reason for everything he's no it's something better it means wait and i'm very grateful because looking in retrospect and what i want for myself in future i'm grateful that i didn't get that job <laughs> if you get what i mean i'm grateful i got this one i just i love the job so much i'm sure you guys can tell with the work we are working late tonight or going to work during weekends even even if i know that is uh, going to work late nights or doing extra hours or um, going to work on weekends obviously it's because we need certain things to be done before the new week you know how it is at the bank but yeah it is what it is now where's my faith with god ah uh, my faith is is thriving now before it was it was it was just somehow and then boom it clicks that um i've been i'm now in the middle of what i prayed for and it, it seems like i don't have time for god it's just very it's very rude it's prideful basically like I, okay i could spend four hours in the presence of god now i can't even spend 10 minutes to even read open my bible and journal and pour out my heart to god tell god how how is god judging faithful it was just very it has just been very chaotic but like i'm so grateful that god is god i'm so grateful that he's merciful because he has given me another chance and i'm not taking it for granted i've been holding it like if at all i must spend five minutes because it is what it is it was it was a struggle getting up early because my mornings now is not really how my morning mornings were last year last year i could wake up in the morning and obviously I plan, now it's like once i wake up it's work i just have to prepare for work to pack my lunch and boom i'm out of the house but now it's like no matter how much i wake up by my normal 4 4 a.m routine it doesn't still seem enough for me to pray time for god but like i, I literally had to take it to god like god you gave me this job I cannot not now have time for you. So just give me time to be able to follow. And I'm grateful that he's God. He has, he has given me the time to be able to follow. And I'm so grateful for him. I see there are so many things I want to say about God. But like, it's just, I am very, very grateful because he's, he's just a good father. He's Abba, he's Abba, he's Ebenezer. He's, he's just my help, basically. Um. Also, I also said something about goals. Um... I've said achieving some of my goals, but some of them <laughs> it gets to get. So I've decided that some of my goals I'll use it to reward myself at the at, at the end of so I'll pattern my goals per month. Okay, this month I want to achieve the certain goals. One that is my reward for the month, achieving a particular goal. If something else come up, fine. If something else will come up, fine. But that month, if the goal that one of my goals okay is to dye my hair that month i'll dedicate it to dye my hair this month i want to dedicate it to losing weight so i'll buy everything needed for home workout and whatnot talking about losing weight oh my i've not even had time to go back to the gym so i've decided to do home workout so one month i'll just dedicate it bam this month i'm going to get everything needed for home home workout things i'm going to use for the house gym wears yoga mats i'll get to ask that that like that like that that's that to my goal because if i sound to lump it together i'll be overwhelmed how did I get this idea? The God in heaven that I saw. Because I was very overwhelmed with the fact that I don't have time for him. Or like my goals is like I'm not achieving it. And when the third month of the year and that April is like two weeks away, if I'm not mistaken. So yeah. What else? What else? Um friendship wise, I've made new friends. Some of them are not here any longer. I miss my friends. Adulting is a lot. 
um having to deal with the fact that your friends are not where you are i miss i miss my people like i can't just pop up at their place as i would love to but it is what is adults in the situation of the country but we give god the glory regardless i don't know this vlog <laughs> this vlog yeah i mean this video it is what it is i just have to give you guys an update as to where i am right now um thinking of new video ideas if you guys have please let me know i know that some some other videos will come up after this and when you guys are saying this you'll see other videos but just drop any video you think you have in mind for me in the comment section and i will do that and i'll put it like after all the other ones i might have created before after you get the gist so yeah hope you guys understand what i am saying hope you guys understand hope you guys get it uh yeah i think that's the end of, of this vlog my sit down videos are somewhat chaotic if we're looking at it because what did i wear <laughs> so yeah i will see you guys when i see you guys in the next video bye babies